Captions make video content accessible to more people in all sorts of circumstances. And cloud-based speech-to-text recognition services now make it possible for developers to add this capability into apps. So I tested auto-captioning in five apps. I used two sentences I've previously used in 2015 and 2017 tests. Here's how AutoCap, Kapwing, and Caption This auto-captioned my video. In November 1660, 12 people met at Gresham College in London to talk about a common interest, science. The group met often to discuss experiments and share ideas, and it eventually evolved into what we now know as the Royal Society. I also tried the same test with Apple Clips. In November 1660, 12 people met at Gresham College in London to talk about a common interest, science. The group met often to discuss experiments and share ideas, and it eventually evolved into what we now know as the Royal Society. And I uploaded the video and enabled auto-captioning at YouTube. In November 1660, 12 people met at Gresham College in London to talk about a common interest, science. The group met often to discuss experiments and share ideas, and it eventually evolved into what we now know as the Royal Society. For details about each of these apps, see my article at techrepublic.com. Any of these captioning tools can save you some time. But you should also plan to make minor edits, since none of these tools adds punctuation perfectly. I'm Andy Wolber, at AWolber on Twitter, for Tech Republic.